Rumors of violence against migrants from North India have gripped the state of Tamil Nadu since mid-February. Fake videos claim that locals in Coimbatore and Tirupur, which have become migrant hubs, are brutally attacking Bihari migrants. Tweets about such attacks and public murders went viral. Newspapers ran headlines like, murderous attack on Hindi-speaking workers in Tamil Nadu. And when RJD leader Tejaswi Yadav visited Tamil Nadu for Chief Minister Stalin's birthday, this issue began to fuel a political fire. Soon, the state authorities across Tamil Nadu, Bihar, Jharkhand and Odisha swung into action to assuage fears. Cases were registered against social media users, newspapers like the Hindustan and Danik Jagran, the website Op India, and even a BJP spokesperson. Tamil Nadu police have sent multiple teams to Bihar to identify people posting fake news on social media. I travelled to Tirupur as well as Coimbatore and spoke to the migrant population. And what I found was that while the fear may be real, videos doing the rounds have so far all been fake. Everyday anxieties and microaggressions that surround migrants anywhere in the world, like accusations of taking away jobs from locals, driving down wages for local labour, and not learning local languages, got a macabre twist in Tamil Nadu. Disinformation. And the usual suspect, WhatsApp forwards. The authorities have since then issued multiple statements dismissing the videos as fake. I am Sailendra Babu, Director General of Police and Head of the Police Force, Tamil Nadu Police speaking. Somebody in Bihar has posted a false and mischievous video saying that the migrant workers of Bihar are attacked in Tamil Nadu. Two videos are posted in that and both are false videos. These two incidents happened in earlier in time in Tirupur and in Payambatur and in both cases they are not clashed between the people of Tamil Nadu and the migrant workers. One is the clash between between two groups of Bihari migrant workers. Another video is a clash between the local residents of Payambatur. They are all Tamil Nadu people. When that is a fact, your facts are twisted to make it appear as if the migrant workers of Bihar are attacked in Tamil Nadu. Here, people are living very peacefully. Law and order is maintained very well and strictly in the state of Tamil Nadu. All the people are living in harmony. Migrants in Tirupur and Coimbatore that the prince spoke to said that they are treated well and have not faced any violence. But despite the state doing all it can to stop this information, they are still worried for their safety. Most of those who left Tamil Nadu had gone home for Holi, but panic has cast shadow on facts. Just outside Coimbatore is a village called Kupipalyam, where migrants live in harmony with their Tamil landlords, calling them Amma and Appa. We leave you with these visuals of their Holi celebration, together away from the panic, fake videos and disinformation. <laughs> This is Vandana Menon for The Print.